Hmm. Oh. Hey there. Isn't that time already? Yeah? Guess it is. Guess it is. Hold on, I want to show y'all something. Oh, brewed our first batch of kombucha. Homebrew, supposed to be good for your gut. Been drinking it quite a bit lately. This one's blackberry green tea. Mmm. It'll be ready by Saturday. What up everybody, it's Justin Romine here. In today's 30 Second Thursday, I wanna go over my run and gun setup for my picture profiles. I use this on my Sony a7 III, my a6300. It really works for any of the Sony mirrorless cameras. Now in this video, I am not gonna go over my actual picture profile settings. If you are interested in that, drop me a comment below. I'd love to hear from you, might make a video about it. Now if you shoot in a wide variety of locations like I do, and it's always run and gun, wouldn't it be nice if Sony just made one picture profile that worked across the board in daylight and low light scenarios? All right, let's start the 30 seconds and get rolling. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna tap menu, you're gonna go to the camera two icon, Custom Operation 1, it's gonna be page eight of nine, on the Sony a7 III at least. Go down one to the Movie Custom key. Set Custom Button 2 to be Picture Profile. Now hit Menu two times to exit. Now, if you already have your picture profile set up, how you like them and everything, all you have to do is tap that Custom 2 key, and boom, it'll pull it up and you can quickly switch between different picture profiles for different lit scenarios. I'd recommend having two picture profiles that you can alternate between, whether you're in daylight or in a inside low light environment. Personally, I like using S-Log2 or HLG if I'm outside and I wanna get the widest dynamic range. But when I'm inside and the dynamic range isn't as high, I like using actually no picture profile because lately I've been doing a lot of testing and I've noticed that having the camera set to no picture profile produces very little grain. Well, that's it for me, filmmakers. Thanks for tuning into my channel. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe. Drop me a like and a comment. I would love to hear from you and we'll catch you in the next video.